Hello, hello, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Anna Mae. Today, I'm gonna to be decorating my room for Christmas, so I thought I would bring you along. I'm not doing Vlogmas this year. I've said that in a couple other previous videos for a bunch of different reasons. If you're new here, I recently graduated with my master's in peace and development studies, and I was commuting to a university close to home, so I was living at home. I thought it was only gonna be for a year, but you know, Miss Rona came about, so we're still here, we're still looking for a job, but I thought it would be nice to like make my room, like make an extra effort with my room this year to make it Christmassy. I don't usually like really decorate my room for Christmas. I have a little mini tree that I'll put up in here, like it's like on a table, it's very small. Um, but I'm gonna put up lights, I'll show you everything I'm gonna put up in my room today. Um, I also just wanna say there's a rug here that isn't usually here, it's nice and red though. I've said it before in other videos as well, We're, we have construction uh, on our house right now and it's basically all under my room. So there's just, and like our house was built in the 1980s which we've learned was like a hellscape for construction so it's basically carpet plywood and then wood beams in the outdoors um so it's pretty much just carpet and plywood between me and four degrees celsius right now so we have some extra rugs down on the floor i guess i'll start at the door so we know what we're doing and then i'll go through all the items i'm using so i'm gonna face behind me when you come in the door there's this kind of situation here it's because this was the original room and then I think they like extended it out. I'm not entirely sure. So over that window, there's the bed, it's unmade. Cause I'm gonna be changing that. I think I'm gonna put some lights over that window there. Um, I'm gonna put some the other string of lights up here. I know I'm definitely gonna do these ones. I'm not sure if I have a socket for the ones over there. And then on this couch, I'm gonna put some, like a red blanket, maybe a cushion if I steal the cushion from downstairs that I want and a mini tree over on the stressor that I've already moved stuff around on. So, oh, also I'm gonna put a wreath on my door. Let's talk through what we're doing. First, I'm gonna be changing my duvet set back to, I've been using this one um, for a little while, but I just never really like it, it's just too dark. Um, so I'm gonna switch back to the white textured one from Ikea that I love, and I just think that'll brighten everything up with all the decorations and cause it's so dark outside. And then, the blanket I have is just, those were command hooks. This is the blanket that we have. Uh, I just found it in a linen closet. Um, these are the lights that we tried to put on the tree. They're like older lights and they're super, super nice, but they are like pretty short strands and they're like three pin plugs. They're not LEDs. So we decided not to put those on the tree this year. They were too much of a hassle. Um, we have other lights on the tree, so I said I would use those for my room. I also have this adorable wreath. So cute, I don't know where this is from, but it's one of my favorite decorations that we have. So I'm gonna put this on my door, I think. And then this tree from Ikea, and we have these teeny tiny gold baubles on it, and I might put needlepoint ornaments on them. So again, if you're new, I needlepoint and these are some of my ornaments. So usually they'd go on like the main tree, but because I'm kind of new to needlepoint, I don't have that many ornaments. Um, so they might just stay there or I might just scatter them in other places in my room. Let's get started. First step, new sheets on the bed. Did that work? <laughs> and then make it look cute. So I just added the little blanket. That's a pillow I cross-stitched. I actually cross-stitched it for my mom, but we're gonna use it. And the fairy lights, they're always there. So next step, I guess, is to collect all the command hooks and to try and get everything hanging up in here. Actually, it's not. It's time to put the tree up. The tree is in place. The ornaments are so oversized on it, but it doesn't matter. Also, I'm obsessed with my This Is Fine, my official 2020 ornament. Link to my needlepoint shop will be down below, of course, but I've decided I'm gonna use, I'm just obsessed with this wreath, but I'm gonna attach the wreath using the Velcro strips from Command. You know, the, like picture hanging ones, because I'm actually thinking I might do different wreaths, like for different seasons. Also, it just comes off really easy. So, 
Then above this window, I've also figured out that there is a plug socket behind that, which is amazing. So I'm gonna put the clear hook on the other side because you can't really tell, but there's like a little hook for where you like would wrap the blind cord if you had small kids. I think like legally they have to put them in. So I'm gonna put the clear one on the other side. And then here is where things might be more complicated. I'm not sure, but I guess we'll figure out. Sorry for making you motion sick walking around. look really cute they're a bit messy honestly but it's fine it looks cute it looks Christmassy so last one to tackle is here and what I've noticed is that the light the strings of lights are actually quite short I think I could probably only get it to stretch like it can't go up and across it could just just go across even at that I'm not sure if it's gonna stretch so I think I might just see the thing is I could just put it around this bookshelf but I actually don't have any sockets near here there's one on this side and it's what I use for charging my computer because it's where I work here. So I don't really know. I guess I'm gonna have to try and figure out something um, where I can try and put the other string of lights because I do really want them because I'm gonna like tidy up the couch and everything. But like it, like with those lights on and those lights on, the little tree, the wreath on the door, it is, it's cute, but there could be more, you know? So I'm gonna try and figure that out. Somehow I forgot that I could just get an extension cord. So we decided to put the lights up here and they look really cute. I like the distribution of the lights around the room now and we're done. So I'm gonna show you what it's like as you walk into my room, it looks so cute now. I'm gonna turn off the overhead lights and just all the lamps and see how cozy and Christmassy it is. That is it for today's video. Hopefully it wasn't too long. I'm just decorating, but I thought it would be fun to share all the same because not much else is happening right now. If you enjoyed, subscribe to my channel. Honestly, usually I think my content's a little bit more interesting than this, but I thought it would be fun to share anyways. Follow me on Instagram at Animate by Design and I will see you in my next video.